Welcome to UTV Hitchworks, home of the farm boy. In this video, we are demonstrating the proper installation of the manual selector valve on the Bobcat Toolcat 5600 C-Series and earlier. First, raise the dump bed. Be sure to put the dump bed lock in place, then remove the radiator screen. Remove the two bolts shown using an appropriately sized socket. Attach the selector valve as shown using the two provided bolts. Disconnect the lines currently going to the driver's side cylinder. Take those lines and install them on the supply ports of the selector valve as shown. Top cylinder line to top port and bottom cylinder line to bottom port. The bottom hose may require the provided extension depending on your vehicle. Connect the two shorter provided lines from the T-fittings on the selector valve back to the cylinder top cylinder line to top port, and bottom cylinder line to bottom port. Disconnect the lines currently going to the passenger side cylinder and attach the provided plug and cap. Route the long pair of hydraulic lines from the selector valve through the tubing as shown, coming up through the hole and bracket to the passenger side cylinder. Zip tie these hoses to the radiator cage. Connect the hoses to the passenger side dump bed cylinder, top cylinder line to top port and bottom cylinder line to bottom port. Be sure to zip tie all of the hoses together and out of the way of any moving parts. Then zip tie all lines on the driver side together to keep them away from any moving parts. Next replace the radiator screen and lower the dump bed making sure that the hoses will not get pinched. When operating the selector valve, simply pop the knob up or down to switch between the dump bed and the auxiliary ports. Finished installation should look like this. For more information on the selector valve or any of our other products, visit us at utvhitchworks.com. 